What is functional group isomerism? Well, the compounds having the same molecular formula but different functional groups are called functional isomers. For instance, consider functional group of ether and functional group of alcohol. Remember that functional isomers exist between ether and alcohol. For example, consider this ether and this alcohol. Now let me write their molecular formula. We can see that in this molecule, there are two atoms of carbon, there are six atoms of hydrogen and there is one atom of oxygen. So the molecular formula of this compound is C2H6O. While in this molecule, we can see that there are two atoms of carbon, there are six atoms of hydrogen and there is one atom of oxygen. So the molecular formula of this compound is C2, H6 and O. Thus they both have the same molecular formulae but they have the different functional groups. This molecule has ether functional group and this molecule has alcohol functional group. We therefore say that these are the functional isomers. Thus remember that ether and alcohol have the functional isomers. Secondly, Consider functional group of aldehyde and ketone. Functional isomers also exist between ketones and aldehyde. For example, consider this aldehyde and this ketone. Now let me write their molecular formulae. Here, in this molecule, we can see that there are three atoms of carbon, there are six atoms of hydrogen and there is only one atom of oxygen. So the molecular formula of this compound is C3H6O. While in this molecule, we can see that there are three atoms of carbon, there are six atoms of hydrogen and there is only one atom of oxygen. So the molecular formula of this compound is C3H6O. Thus they both have the same molecular formulae but they have different functional groups. Therefore we say that they are the functional isomers. Thus remember that aldehyde and ketones have functional isomers. Thirdly, consider the functional group of carboxylic acid and functional group of ester. Functional isomers exist between them. For example, consider this carboxylic acid and this ester. Now let me write their molecular formulae. In this molecule, we can see that there are three carbon atoms, there are six hydrogen atoms and there are two atoms of oxygen. While in this molecule, there are three atoms of carbon, there are six atoms of hydrogen and there are two atoms of oxygen. So the molecular formula of carboxylic acid is C3H6O2 and the molecular formula of ester is also C3H6O2. Thus they both have the same molecular formulae but they have the different functional groups. Therefore we say that these both are the functional isomers. So remember that carboxylic acid and esters have functional isomers. Lastly, consider functional group of alkene and cycloalkane. For example, consider this alkene and this cycloalkane. Now let me write their molecular formulae. In this molecule, we can see that there are four atoms of carbon and there are eight atoms of hydrogen. So the molecular formula of this compound is C4H8. While in this compound, we can see that there are also four atoms of carbon and there are eight atoms of hydrogen. So the molecular formula of this compound is also C4H8. Hence they both have the same molecular formulae but they have different functional groups. Therefore, we say that they both are the functional isomers. So remember that alkene and cycloalkane have functional isomers. Now to summarize this whole lecture, we have learned that functional isomer exists between ether and alcohol, aldehyde and ketone, carboxylic acid and ester, alkene and cycloalkane. Also, we have learned two new functional groups like ether and ester. If you have missed our lecture on functional groups, then watch this lecture and its link is given in the description.